Yo, what is up? I hope you're doing amazing today. My name's Austin, and in today's video, I'm going to show you guys how to farm froggy chairs, all right? Now, this farming method works for any item in the game. I'm just using froggy chairs for this example. If you don't have a froggy chair yet, I'm going to show you how you can easily get one because there's multiple different ways of getting a froggy chair. And once you get a froggy chair, you only need one froggy chair, and then you can start farming them. I'm going to show you a way how you can get every single variant, every single color, a very easy way to do so. And then I'm going to show you how you can make a ton of bells, a ton of Nook Mile tickets by reselling these froggy chairs. I was actually selling froggy chairs yesterday, and I made about 50 Nook Mile tickets in only like three transactions. So it took about, I don't know, 10 or 15 minutes, but it was pretty sweet though. Also too, I just want to let you know that I am planning a froggy chair giveaway. Uh, just because this channel has grown so fast lately, and I really appreciate you guys watching my videos. So I really want to give back to you guys and, you know, do a little froggy chair giveaway. Um, it'll probably be a live stream. So if you don't want to like miss out on the live stream, just make sure you're subscribed with your notifications turned on. That way you'll be notified when I go live and I'll start handing out the froggy chairs. But um, yeah, so let's get straight into the video. So how can you get one of these froggy chairs? Well, there's multiple different ways you can get one. They come out of balloons. Uh, they come out of trees. If you like shake the trees, you have a chance to get a froggy chair. They may fall out from a tree. Uh, your villagers could gift you a froggy chair. That's also a possibility. Uh, you can also get them from uh, Timmy and Tommy from the Nook's Cranny. And you can also get it from Red. All right. Now, if you're impatient like I was, the fastest way to get a froggy chair would be to just go on Nookazon and go buy one, right? Now, if you haven't used Nookazon before, it's basically the Amazon of Animal Crossing. All right. Um, I think it's a very safe site. I've never had any issues or any scams or anything like that. I mean, there's always like a 1% chance that it could happen, but overall, I think it's a very safe site. All right, so let's pretend that you have your froggy chair. You either found it in the Nook's Cranny or you got it from Balloon or you ordered it from Nookazon. The next step would be to farm the froggy chair, all right? And how you would do that is you would basically go to your Nook shopping app now, if you don't have the Nook shopping app, you'll have to go to the ABD uh, and order it from there. Uh, you get the Nook shopping app once you've placed over 100 orders, I do believe, uh, with the Nook shopping uh, at the ABD. But uh, anyway, so once you're here, all you would need to do is you would need to go down. It is in housewares, I do believe. And here it is, the beloved froggy chair. So what you'll need to do is you'll need to order five of these, all right? I mean, realistically, you can order as many as you want, but I would just order five for right now. And I'll show you what you need to do once you order five froggy chairs, all right? All right, so once you've ordered your five froggy chairs from the catalog, you should have six froggy chairs right now. Um, and what you'll need to do is you'll need to go over to Harv's Island. As you can see, we're at Harv's Island right now. And you're going to want to have this shop unlocked, all right? Now, if you don't have Harv's Island unlocked yet, uh, in my last video that I uploaded, I did like a little tour of Harv's Island, and I, sh I tell you guys how you can unlock Harv's Island. Um, you're going to want to have this shop unlocked, and this is Reese and Cyrus's shop. And basically what they do is they customize items for you, okay? Um, and this is where you're going to get all the other variants, right? So you only need one froggy chair to get all the other variants because we can customize it. And if you ordered, you know, five more from the catalog, you can essentially get one of each color, right? They come in green, pink, light blue, yellow, orange, and blue with like some black spots. Kind of like a cheetah, like cheetah blue, cheetah orange. <laughs> but uh, yeah, it only costs like a thousand bells to customize, so basically pennies. So once you're done customizing all your froggy chairs, you should have one of each color. So you can actually come back to your Nook shopping app and you'll have all the colors unlocked. See, we have all the colors unlocked. And that way you can just order like as many froggy chairs as you want, as many colors as you want for like 1400 bells. And you know, if you guys watch my videos, that's basically pocket change for you guys. So you can basically just start buying as many froggy chairs as you want and pretty much farm them, you know, because it's only 1400 bells. That's basically pennies. So once you've done that, you should have a bunch of froggy chairs farmed, right? And it'll probably look something like this, depending on like how many froggy chairs you ordered. And now here's where the fun really begins. So now you can start selling all these froggy chairs and make a ton of bells or Nook Mile tickets, really whatever you want, really. 
Yeah, and here's my favorite place to sell the froggy chairs. As you can see, people are selling froggy chairs for hundreds of Nook Mile tickets. Now, if you want to sell your froggy chairs fast, I wouldn't price them that high. I recommend pricing them around maybe 10 or 20 Nook Mile tickets. You can also just like price it as, you know, just accepting offers and see what people give you. Um, I did that with one of my transactions and I got like 30 Nook Mile tickets uh, just for one froggy chair. But I, I typically, you know, would, would recommend pricing pricing them at around 10 or 20 Nook Mile tickets, just so you can sell them fast. If you don't know how to sell on Nookazon, it's very, very easy. You just gotta create an account, and then you go over here to add a listing, and very, very simple, right? So you just go ahead and we'll type in froggy chair right here, right? And you'll just go ahead and like, you know, pick the color that you wanna sell. I recommend, you know, selling like one color at a time, just because if you have all those different colors in your inventory, it's most likely going to get confusing. Now, I do believe we can access our storage while people are on our island. So you might be able to keep um, some froggy chairs in the storage and get them out that way. Um, but I, I don't know. I haven't tested that, but I, it's just something that I think that we can do now. But uh, yeah, you just go ahead and select the, the color of the froggy chair. Let's say ours is green. Uh, you type in one. And right here, you can ask for like as many Nook Mile tickets as you want. We can do like we want to sell this for 10 Nook Mile tickets and just bam, add a listing. Yeah, and once you've added a listing, uh, people will be sending you some offers. So you'll be getting some offers in your, uh, your notifications. So like this little bell right here will let you know if you got an offer or not. And then after that, you'll be able to accept the offer. Uh, then after you accept the offer, you'll have the option to give them uh, your Dodo code. Or sometimes they may give you their Dodo code and you may come to their island. But generally, if you're the one selling, you're the one giving the Dodo code. And uh, yeah, then they'll be coming to your island and they'll give you uh, the Nook Mile tickets, bells, or whatever um, you asked for. And uh, you'll give them the froggy chair and you just kind of just, you know, repeat that. Uh, you will need to have Nintendo online, so just keep that in mind. But um, yeah, I hope this video was helpful and I'll catch you later.